On Thursday, the Australian Boomers took on USA Basketball and won two games at Marvel Stadium to prepare for the FIBA World Cup. The event had been heavily criticised after several NBA All-Stars, including Australian Ben Simmons, pulled out of the game. The criticism was speculated to cause a loss of numbers at the game. Despite this, thousands of people still flocked to the event Thursday night. Um, I think it definitely had a little bit of an effect. Um, you know, people wanted to come out and see the big stars, especially Ben Simmons play for the Boomers. I think Ben Simmons was probably the biggest pullout. We were expecting <coughs> a lot of the American stars to pull out. and. Um, it probably made it a close game, but uh, yeah, I think everyone, lots of people, I still went, um, I was super excited to go, so I still went and had a, had a good weekend around, so um, yeah, definitely an effect, but not, not a major. In the first game on Thursday, the Boomers fell to USA Basketball with the final score being 102-86, to with 23 points coming from Boston Celtics star Kemba Walker, while Chris Goulding put up 19 points for the Boomers in a solid shooting performance. Yeah, I thought the, uh, it was a really good game. It was a bit disappointing the Boomers couldn't get up and sort of got blown away in the second half. But despite the big loss on Thursday night, Saturday saw Game 2 tip off at 2pm with families from all across the country coming to watch the event. With a crowd attendance of over 52,000, the crowd was much more electric Saturday afternoon and picked up as the game began to get tighter and the Boomers found their rhythm against the world's best team. Huge, you know. A bit, bit slow to start off with in the first couple of quarters, but then heading on to the fourth, everyone got up and about, especially when Paddy started you know, doing what he does. Despite the close game, fans still had time to enjoy some entertainment. If you don't know the words, they're on the screen. You know the The event was a huge success, especially when the Boomers managed to upset USA Basketball on Sunday, winning 98-94 on the back of 30 points from Paddy Mills, beating Team USA for the first time in Australian history. Fans also got to see their favourite players live. It's got to be... Paddy or it's got to be Joe Ingles hand of the ball. For others, it was the chance to see the USA superstars that really got them engaged. I think Kem can't go past Kemba Walker. Um, he was just su super smooth. Um, boomers couldn't stay in front of him. Uh, lit it up from the floor, yeah. The Boomers will begin their FIBA World Cup campaign on the 9th of September, taking on Canada.